This is Mr. Public Flatulence. Mr. Public Flatulence loves baked beans. He eats them on toast for breakfast, in sandwiches for lunch, and with everything for dinner. One day, after a sneaky between meals baked bean smoothie, Mr. Public Flatulence realized he only had three cans of baked beans left in his cupboard. Mr. Public Flatulence's passion for baked beans was such that this was less than a day's supply. So Mr. Public Flatulence took a walk to his local supermarket to buy some more. He just bought 12 cans of baked beans when he felt a bubbling in his stomach. Mr. Public Flatulence decided it would be a good idea to visit the supermarket toilets, but the toilets were all in use. Mr. Public Flatulence was starting to get a pain. So as not to embarrass himself, Mr. Public Flatulence decided to go to the public toilets in the square, but the public toilets were locked. Mr. Public Flatulence's tummy pain was getting worse. He had an idea. He quickly walked to the park. But there was a football match in the park and there were family members everywhere. Mr. Public Flatulence's stomach was getting very painful. So as not to embarrass himself, he hurried away and started towards home. His stomach grumbled painfully. Mr. Public Flatulence was determined not to embarrass himself. Outside his house, Mr. Public Flatulence searched for his keys. Oh no, Mr. Public Flatulence, where are your keys? Mr. Public Flatulence was getting desperate. He decided to go to the back door. Mr. Public Flatulence hurried out of the gate straight into Mrs. Senior Citizen. He let one slip. He hurried round the corner, straight into Mrs. Yummy Mummy. What? Another slipped out. Mr. Public Flatulence, his tummy was in agony now. He was feeling very embarrassed. He ran around the side of the house. Straight into PC Fuzz. Mr. Public Flatulence was horrified. He lost all control. <laughs> Poor Mr. Public Flatulence was mortified. PC Fuzz was not happy. He fined Mr. Public Flatulence for breaking wind in a public place. Seven times. Mr. Public Flatulence learned a valuable lesson that day. If you can't hold on, let it all go in one great big trouser-rattling, ear-splitting, toe-curling fart. It costs less. Thank <laughs> you.